and welcome back to Grow and Glow channel. Uh, my name is Pascal. Today I'm going to show you how to grow uh, palm trees from seeds. Uh, it's actually very, very simple. Most palm trees will have some sort of fruit. This one here has uh, these uh, red fruits. Uh, there is abundance of them. Other ones that don't go red are different types of ones. And these are the seeds. Uh, the shell falls off them after a while and then you're left with the seed. Uh, you have, this is what the seeds look like after the, they fall on the ground. I will show you here. So that's what they look like. And uh, what I will do is I will gather up a f two or three of these and grow them. Palm trees uh, take a long time to grow. I'm going to scarify the seeds you know, with hot water and steep them for a couple of days. And then I will, uh, I will go the other side. It's piping hot here today and uh, you can see the water coming down and I'm in the shade. Uh, it's probably about 35 degrees or maybe 36 degrees. So uh, I'll go, uh, I'll go, so I'll go out the other side where it's a, a little bit cooler and we will put these in water. So I'm out to come on out here to the back garden. The, the, the house is bl blocking the sun for the time being. It's morning time here and the sun is rising on that side. You can see it's sunny down there. So I'm going to put them into water. I'm going to put them into hot water. Uh, you can have it very hot. Uh, I wouldn't put it boiling. I don't think it'll do. But what it'll do is it'll soften the shell and it might speed up the germination of the seed. So how long will I leave it here? 24, 48 hours or when I get some time. Uh, they will be fine. Uh, they say if the seed uh, f floats on the top, it's not viable, and if it sinks to the bottom, it is. I, uh, that's not exactly true. I've done it with other seeds as well. So I'll just pour the water in there. They will float. Well, they're not all floating. <laughs> Only one of them's floating, but anyway, we will so we're going to sow the whole six of them. Or the seven actually there. Yeah, that one doesn't look very good, but that's that one is not that's the one I was demonstrating with the skin falling off, but we'll put that in as well. So we'll just leave that uh, somewhere and uh, I'll get back to you in a couple of minutes and we will sew them. Okay, so I left them a little bit longer than than I wanted it because I wasn't ready to do them and we were busy this week, but I left them for f uh, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday. Five days, four days, four days, four days in the water. Uh, I, norm, I only meant to leave them for two days, but we're going to take them out and sow them anyway. I don't, they don't seem to be cause them any harm. Soften them a little bit only, but so uh, I'm not a hundred percent sure which way to put them. So I'll put them sideways, like we do when, when you're growing a coconut. So we we'll just put them in, and I just barely cover them. I'm not, go I'm not going to cover them too much. When we're growing coconuts, we don't cover them at all. I'll just stick them in like that in that. They're very big, so you can put them down uh, maybe the top of them more than a quarter an inch if you want to. And then I'm going to water them in. And uh, we see how it goes, you know. But we've grown them before, so I'm confident they will grow. M maybe not that one. That one uh, uh, wasn't the, that was the one that wasn't fresh. So we just stick them in like this. You see, they're, they... They look the same as what they looked like when I showed you them uh, in the first part. I have only seven seeds, I have eight pots. My mathematics is not so good today. Um, think about that. And uh, what I'll do then, I'm doing this in the morning because the sun is the other side of the house. And as you can see, the ocean in the back there, it's a nice day today. It's, but it's going to be very, very hot later. And uh, I'll just give them a watering in and keep them moist. I'll put them in. Uh, I, I, everywhere is warm here but I won't put them in full sun but when they get a bit of light I'll give them a bit of sun this is my daughter's one and it's dripping but it's okay so we just leave them and I won't say forget about them but we leave them and not worry too much because they're going to take a while and I'll be back to you in a few minutes and we'll see what happened Okay, it's been 23 days now since we uh, sowed these. Uh, I thought I sowed eight. There's, uh, there are only seven pots here. Uh, one of them was dug up by a bird and I put it back down in again. We have uh, four of these already have uh, shoots and uh, I'm surprised it's 23 days and you can see one here. Can you see this shoot here? And it's very, very hot and sunny here. Uh, maybe I've put a bit of shade there. You can see it. You see it here? Yeah. Oh, uh, yeah. So four of them already uh, shooted up after 23 days. I'm happy. So uh, 
I'll be back to you again in a couple of weeks and see how they do. Okay, so uh, it's now exactly uh, 45 days since we sowed the seeds. One of them went missing, I think the dog got it, but I don't think it had grown. So we have six of them, so more grew since the last time. This one is ready to uh, change its leaves, uh, it's got ready to spread out. So uh, I'm going to finish the video up now in a few minutes. Uh, they, they're great success with them. They stay in these pots for a long time. I will show you one I grew here in like, uh, about nine months ago. So this is one uh, we grew, um, I think, uh, about nine months ago. And uh, we forgot about it, so that's why it's still in the pot and the roots are coming out the bottom. I'm going to put that into a bigger pot now. That should be a, uh, maybe twice the size of this if we looked after it. So that's my video on growing uh, palm trees from seed. Uh, it's not such a difficult thing to do. Uh, they don't take a lot of care. Uh, these ones will be left in the sun now, uh, full sun. Uh, doesn't matter where we leave them here now. Uh, they've already reached the stage that they will grow big and uh, maybe get a little bit of rot on them. That's probably scorched from the sun, I don't know. Uh, so uh, thank you very much for watching uh, this uh, video. And uh, if you like this video or any of our other videos, uh, please consider subscribing.